Hunter got to get it up. Waters got it right back. Got it up to the rim. It carries right to Saar. Reload three. Robinson Earl. How about his third three of the first half? You know, it's just part of, you know, the, the business that, you know, obviously first year with the Suns and, you know, they're very happy with them. And obviously, you're very happy with Saar when he knocks down the three as well. Bench really stabilized this game. Waters got a flyby. Saar, 1-3, make it two. This one right down the pipe straight away. Now he's got to defend McGee in the post, who faces up. McGee likes to get right to the cup, and that should be last touch by Phoenix, and it is. That was the defense there from Saar. When you have players in your system that know how to play Thunder basketball, it turns out to be fairly seamless on the court in terms of trying to make plays for one another. Got the spin move. Olivier Saar making a play. They're 5 of 28 from downtown. Thunder doing a good job of defending those threes. I'll do the math. That's about 18%. Oh, two shade to Pokashevsky. He recognized and then fired it right down to Saar for the authoritative slam. That hasn't been a part of the 42% as we go to this fourth quarter, and it starts out with an emphatic block from Olivier Saar. Well, you see nine more threes made by the Thunder in this game. Saar trying to make it 10, and he does. Pokashevsky and Saar, they've just been playing a two-person game for about the last five minutes. See all the quick decisions that the Thunder are making. The ball not sticking. Man, how about the day of Saar? Michael, he's got four threes. Thunder right now has got a 49 to 33 advantage. That was one of our keys as well as, come on, man. Uh, I'm sorry, I had to stop it. Get one of those to Cage. Even without Booker, Aiden, Crowder going for the W. Didn't get it. Pokashevsky getting pressured in the backcourt by Peyton. And add one more assist. There it is, and it's appropriate that it goes to Saar for assist number 12.